this is a devastating specialty. It's a specialty where you can make a diagnosis, but the best you can tell the parents is that we really can't do anything for your child. And the even more sad uh, thing you do is quite often you tell them, this might happen again. And I could not bear the thought that I'm gonna spend the rest of my career handing out bad news and feeling I can do nothing. And when we reflect on the billions of dollars spent on treating them, think how much better we would do if we really invest in the research so that they can have a better quality of life. So what we're hoping to do is this period of basic discovery that almost you can pick any medical problem for which there's an effective treatment. On average, it's 25 to 30 years. For certain things like TPA that's used in heart attack strokes, even longer than that. This is what we hope to shorten, because if we shorten that, we know that the period from a successful treatment in an animal model to a human is certainly within the frame of five years, because that's what the experience tell us from other studies. And what I would really want to do is continue to do the research I'm doing till I see a drug in a human patient of mine that made them better. I am uh, very humbled by the complexity of the brain. I'm very humbled by these diseases. So I don't say I'm going to cure a disease. No, I don't think that's realistic of me to think I will take a disease and totally cure it. But what I would really like to do is at least see these patients doing a lot more enjoying life a lot more, doing what they can, what I feel if I unlock some things I can get them to do. Because there's nothing more noble than doing research to help patients.